What up guys, welcome to the Lightning Show and today we're doing a Black Ops 2 commentary. Real quick about this gameplay, I went 20 and 5 which is actually pretty good for a gun game because you know you always have a UAV on and the enemy can predict what you're doing and you can predict what they're doing so you're gonna need some lightning reflexes sometimes on some of these battles and you gotta know a lot of these guns like the ranges and stuff so I hope you enjoy the gameplay and I'm gonna jump to the commentary. The life of a small YouTube channel. That is the subject today and what inspired me to do this is I was on Twitter yesterday and I follow Machinima on Twitter. So they retweeted one of their followers and partners and who came up with Descendant. I never heard of him before so I went to check out the channel and the first video I saw was um, the one that Phoenix 2 did on his channel and look at that guy just get owned trying to knife me. He was talking about how much time and effort we put into our videos as a commentator or a YouTuber whatever you want to call yourself but we put a lot of time and effort into our videos sometimes and really like he said it's harder than you think it's not you know, you gotta record gameplay and you gotta um, just upload it and post it say some random stuff to it I mean you always want to find the highest quality of um, videos that you possibly can because you know none of us want to upload something just BS even your big channel if you upload something that's BS like you don't do research on like I seen a video that says oh hijack glitch in the back of the boat and everybody knows there's no glitch back there only two small boats and you can get on it but that's not really a glitch and he did honestly he did not do any um, research on it so no matter how big he was, you know, people was like, you're, you're a complete idiot. Um, yeah. So we actually do spend a lot of time, you know, researching up our content unless we're doing a commentary. But even when we're doing commentary as right now, I'm actually thinking about what I want to say. Because I don't want to say the wrong thing and then, you know, offend some people. And that's just really it. So small channels like mine try to do everything we can to get subs and views. Um, but there's one thing that you should never do, which is spam a channel. Like, I've seen channel, even big channels, they be spamming their content. They're like, hey, check out my channel. Um, I hope you like it. And when they go to your channel and do that, it's highly annoying. It's extremely annoying. Like, if I see in the comments, I just, since I'm a small channel, um, I, I can because I have time. Because there's not that much people who do, does it just delete it and sometimes depending on what they do or if they keep doing it I just block them because there's really no point on you spamming my view when I barely have any views that it is to go to your channel because I don't spam I tell you right now I don't spam I, I comment on other channels but I see no point in spamming because it's your your channels your work you know you want people to like you for what you're doing and to get known out there you gotta make good videos I was just talking to Axel from NGT this morning actually and there was a guy spamming all of his viewers and he literally said the same thing if you want good um, good views you know a good amount of views you have to put out good content um, if you like this commentary it was just a quick commentary um, give me a like give me some constructive criticism you know don't just don't say oh you suck and check out Descendant and um, Phoenix 2 videos as well because those two guys, they inspired me, you know. Thanks again and we'll see you next time in the Lightning Show.